hi there okay i as you all know i had covid and i'm now much better i still have the some flu and my throat discomfort a bit but i'm negative already after a few days i feel so much better um and well i have uh, decided to start my video because i have not been doing anything for about more than what what two weeks like that so now i started to i want to share what i have read and this thing has brought a lot of good to me okay so those of you all please take care out there with this covid thing it's not uh, something very nice uh, if you go to my other video you can see some tips to ease the condition of course uh, there's no substitute to medication to ease it at home so you can get better faster i guess okay just to give some is this work for for me and my family but i do not know whether you want to practice it or not okay so let us start with my book today i'm going to review a book called the magic i think a lot of you have seen this by ronda bryan okay the magic it is a very nice book it's a beautiful book it just came to me in time when i was not happy quite sad quite depressed not sure what life is taking uh, a toll in i'm not sure what life is where life is taking me okay and this book is very special because it really did teach me what gratitude is when i started being grateful i saw a lot of changes in my life i'm not just telling it as a story it's a fact a lot of changes in my life of course in life we have a lot of bad and good and all this but by reading this i started being grateful i would say the most important thing is to count our blessings and be grateful for what we have okay don't cry over things that we do not have and if you're grateful enough the things you want you will also get or achieve okay so this is what i learned from this book It's about twenty-eight days, I think, of practice. You just read one chapter a day, and you practice what they ask you to practice. Okay. Ah, uh, this ah uh, very short. This is very ah uh, each chapter is very short, so anybody can read it. Okay, sorry, my mic is slipping. Anybody can read it. Okay, those of you all who don't really like reading. you can read it because one day you read one chapter and then there's for each chapter they have some uh, activities that you can do for example let me show you one of the activities sir huh? i mean not big activities just short things that you can do bring the magic into your life so for this the chapter is small you see you can see can you see it's one page Two, three, and then here four. Can you see four, five? So here, the magic formula. You see, they just tell you what to do on a daily basis. You can do this twenty-eight days. You can do this longer. Okay, it helps you be grateful for some things that you have in life. So it's up to you what you want to do. Um. how long you want to take but this is a very beautiful book okay they have titles like count your blessings okay we we never count our blessings most of us we we think uh, the universe owes us something no nobody owes us anything we need to count our blessings okay and then there's a lot of magic in this world magic as in yeah when you ask when you ask and you be grateful for what you have God will surely shower you with better things. The universe will shower you with better things. This I've seen myself. Simple, simple things. Okay, and there's also I. This I believe there's something called divine timing. Sometimes you want something so badly, but you don't get it. Then you you're so angry about it. Why you didn't get it? But there is a reason for everything. God is actually asking you to wait. 
because your time is not right. With what you get, you could do wonders or you could harm yourself. So God will decide when you are ready to accept it. Have an open heart. Have a heart to receive a lot of things. This it has been a very, very difficult task for me because uh, I'm so used in giving. I'm so used in doing things for others that I didn't think of myself. I stopped thinking of myself for quite some time. So how can I receive? I'm close to receiving. I want something, but I do not want to receive it. So I learn. I'm still learning actually. <coughs> I wouldn't say I, I receive uh, easily. No, I do not receive easily because it's in me herself. But I would love to change. Okay. I would love to change. And this book teaches us about gratitude. Okay. The most powerful thing in life is to be grateful for what we have. What we already have, what we will get in life. So it's already there with us. Only thing we do not know, we do not know the magic is there with us. Many of us do not know that we have magic within us. Okay, each and every one of us has it. Only thing we have not, um, but recognized it, we have not seen it. We are unable to accept it because we are taught. There's no such thing as magic and all this from small, but there truly is. You got to believe. You got to believe in a lot of things in life. Okay. So this book taught me that. I think it's a wonderful read. I would like to read again and again and again. So I'm having it here with me. Okay. Sometimes uh, a lot of things teach us good things and brings us to the path we need to go. It has taught me and brought me to the path. Of course, there are some pointing practices that I have to do, like write a list of gratitude. I, I'm unable to do this because as I am a homeschool mom, I have very limited time with my kids. So, and there are other things to do and all these things. So, I'm not practicing that, but still, I make sure before I sleep each night, I say my gratitude to the universe, to God. Okay, and they are showering me with a lot of good things. I can see this. I can see the change in my life, the positivity. Okay, even starting this YouTube channel is a blessing. I have been thinking about this for a long, long time. But I now come up, uh, come with the courage to do it. Okay, always there's a fear stopping us, fear stopping us now. So, uh, and of course, with the support, full support of my kids, all my three kids have been pushing me and helping me. You see, I, I'm not an expert in video taking and I'm not an expert in um, all these technicalities and all they've been teaching me, they've been showing me, they're still helping me. Okay. So, uh, if you have a t your time, get this book and read it. It will help you. Anybody can read it. Okay. I must stay at home mom. So, and now I started to have dreams of my own. All this while I never had. Okay, the magic has taught me a lot of things. I too deserve, when I, you start to see what you're grateful for and what you want in future that you're going to be grateful for. Okay, you can thank, thank the universe, thank God now for what you're going to receive in future. There's nothing wrong in that. So, if you can read it, that would be great. You will help yourself. I'm telling you, this is a very good book. I have read a lot of books, a lot of motivational books. Okay, through the years, I've read a lot of books. This book is truly a magic. You should please try it. Okay, hopefully, with all the good things coming around, all good blessings will come to you from the universe, from God. Or whoever you believe in. Okay. And even within you, if you are positive in life and you are grateful for what you have, you will definitely receive the best. So try this book. Okay. The Magic by Rhonda Bynes.
so <clears throat> i hope you read this i hope you enjoy this book okay and i hope you get something out of it i i assure you if you really do the work you will get something out of it work on yourself this is a lovely book that's why i took the opportunity to share it with you thank you